What's good everyone? So in this video we're going to be talking about Megan the Stallion being blasted after reports came out that she actually stepped on glass and that Tory Lanez did not actually shudder. You get what I'm saying guys? Now of course y'all know that there's this whole court case going on as it relates to Meg the Stallion and Tory Lanez. So y'all can see why a lot of persons are furious after hearing these reports and stuff like that. So that's what we are going to be discussing in this video guys and I'm going to be reading an article but before I get into it do not forget forget to like this video and also subscribe if you have not subscribed click the notification bell on that way you will get notified whenever I post a new video all right guys so let's get into the story y'all can let me know what y'all think about this in the comment section so it says Megan the stallion blasted amid reports her foot was wounded by glass new information has been unveiled regarding the ongoing legal battle involving rap stars Megan the stallion and Tory Lanez while Megan the stallion has remained it steadfast in her claims of Lanez in intentionally wounding her by firing a gun in her direction. An LAPD report has surfaced that has created an air of doubt surrounding the stallion's recollection of the incident. In recently released documents, the LAPD revealed that Megan allegedly stepped on glass at the scene, resulting in laceration to her left foot. Dr. Lafrida, who treated the stallion, confirmed the laceration was sustained due to her stepping on glass. In the report, officers state they canvassed the scene after responding to a cause of shot being fired, recovering four bullet casings, jewelry, and an acrylic nail. The report also revealed the identity of an eyewitness who says he saw two women, believed to be Megan the Stallion and Kelsey Nicole, in a verbal and physical altercation at the scene, and that two men, believed to be Lanes and his bodyguard, were also present according to the report. Afterward, the suspect got back into a black SUV and left the scene. As details continue to emerge in the shooting investigation, the public appears to be split in terms of whose side of the story they believe. In an exclusive interview with Gail King, Megan the Stallion gave her account of what occurred on the evening in question, accusing Lanes of shooting her and speaking on the impact the incident has had on her in the aftermath. However, Megan's denial of having a sexual relationship with Lanes has led to fans in question of the validity of the claim and how her possible dishonesty could alter her credibility in the eyes of the court and public opinion and with x-rays of the stallion's foot unavailable and the alleged bullet fragments that were taken from her foot unavailable to be found the body wrapper will have to wait until her and lane's day in court for an opportunity to set the record straight once and for all all right guys so what do you think about this do you think that megan the stallion is lying now remember the doctor who actually treated her foot is confirming that she did indeed step on glass so the person who treated her foot is saying it it's not coming from someone who heard it from someone who heard it from someone it's the actual doctor but you know they're not saying that lanes didn't actually fire in her direction so he could have fired in her direction and that is when she maybe like tried to dodge it or whatever it may be and you know stepped on the glass or whatever but either way it's basically not well allegedly it's not the bullet that actually went into her foot you get what i'm saying guys so we'll just have to wait and see as more details emerge you know um, I don't really know what to say, but who do you believe in this whole situation? Megan the Stallion or are you rocking with Tory Lanez? Or do you not even care? Just let me know how y'all feel in the comment section. Alright guys, and thank you all for watching the video. Do not forget to like the video. Do not forget to share the video and also subscribe if you have not done so. And I will see you guys in the next video. Stay safe. Peace.